do you think is important about voting? Um, I think not only is it not only is it a responsibility of democracy, I think it's a great way to ensure democracy exists. People complain a lot about the government, but they don't vote. So if you vote, you're allowed to complain. We have all this freedom, but we don't take advantage of it. So, and we should take advantage of it because so many countries don't have this freedom that we do. Why do you want to be heard? Why? Because the, your voice makes a difference, right? Yeah. So it's best if you say something right now rather than not say something. I can understand people not wanting to get involved and saying it doesn't matter or I don't care what happens. But politics is not something that you study in a textbook. Government matters a lot more than young people tend to think it does. Politics is happening around you every day, all the time. From the water you drink, to the air you breathe, to the roads you drive on, to the kind of education you get, politics is there somewhere. This country is being shaped a little bit and changed a little bit every day by who's in office and what they do. If you're unhappy with the system, the way to change it isn't to sit at home and whine about it. The way to change it is to get involved. Democracy is important because it's, this is the way we run the country and the decisions that are going to get made uh, in any election uh, are going to make a difference to people about uh, how they can live their lives and how the country is going to turn out in the future. The original concept of universal suffrage is that you know, every person was equal and that this was the great defense that the poor and the disadvantaged had over the rich and the advantaged. It gave them leverage uh, and it gave them representation. It gave them the power to elect those who would do good for them and to defeat those who would do bad for them. Our generation has grown up with this idea that we have all of these rights and voting is part of that. Uh, there are lots of places in the world where you don't get this opportunity. Can you imagine living in a country where one or a few people simply decided everything for millions of people. Nobody wants to live in that society. We take so much for granted. I've been in countries where I've seen people in the voting lines on voting day crying because they're so moved at the fact that they finally got the right to vote. People have fought for centuries, um, back thousands of years, for the right to have some control over their life. And you have it. It would be a real shame uh, to not use it. If you vote, then the system will work. You'll keep all these people in check, ideally, and, uh, and that's when it works. When it doesn't work is when we all turn into yahoos. We don't vote, we complain, and we don't do anything about it. Then it doesn't work. We're giving the power to the wrong people. So what do you think about the student vote program? I think the student vote program is very good because uh, we learn early how to do it. I really learned what the whole voting process was like because we're underage, so I never really knew what, what it was all about. I just I knew it was about making a mark on a ballot, but this kind of made it more clear, so now I know what it's going to be like when I'm 18 and I really can vote. I think they liked having their voices heard because we don't get to do that until we're 18, until we can actually vote. So then them voting now is actually like a joy for them because people can know what they actually feel like feel about the election. Because it gives us like a chance to actually think about our community, think about our future, and what we, steps we need to take to change it. Well, like, we're the vote of tomorrow, right? Like, we have the stage tomorrow, so we may as well do it now. 